Good morning. My name is Senior Deputy Mike Baker. I'm with the Camarillo Police Department and Ventura County Sheriff's Department. I head up the Community Resource Unit right now, and I'm here to talk to you today about catalytic converter theft. Catalytic converter is basically a piece of equipment that goes between the motor and the exhaust system, and it reduces emissions into the air. Basically, catalytic converters are an easy target. Your vehicle is parked either in the early morning hours or late at night, and people can come up and remove one within less than a minute. The draw for a catalytic converter is that there's precious metals inside of it. Now, it's not really a lot, but somebody that takes this and takes it off to an illegal recycler or somebody that does something on the side, they can take this in and get $200, $300 for it. Um, just for the precious metals inside, which is make, what makes it such a big draw. Now, in the event that you get a catalytic converter stolen off of your vehicle, it could cost up to around $2,500 to replace it based on what you have. We've got one from a Honda Accord here. We've got one from a Toyota Prius. Don't know what this one's from, but hey, it's still a catalytic converter and it costs money to replace. Certain cars are more targeted because they're easier to get to or because they have a larger catalytic converter. Ford F-150 pickup trucks, they have a big one, so there's gonna be a little bit more uh, precious metals inside of that. I believe the Toyota Priuses are a lot easier to get to, um, plus there's two of them, two for the price of one. Catalytic converter is located between the motor and probably the first half of the vehicle. Typically they're in there. Some of them are in the center of the car, um, some are on the side. So that's what makes a draw for some vehicles to get to because they just have to slide underneath, maybe jack up the car a little bit and get it and they, they can cut it out. But it's between the motor and the first half of the vehicle before it gets to the rear and the exhaust pipes. Best way to avoid catalytic converter theft, if you have to park your vehicle outside of a garage, right? First thing we tell people is in a garage, in a carport, or in a well-lit area. If you have to park it on the street, then under a street light, um, in a secured parking garage, or something like that, depending on where you live. In the event that you have your catalytic converter stolen off of your vehicle, you probably want to have it towed. The telltale sign that your catalytic converter is no longer there is when you start your car, it's going to sound like a straight pipe Harley Davidson. It's going to be loud and obnoxious. So you might want to call a tow truck, have it towed to a garage to have it fixed. So what to do if you witness a catalytic converter theft taking place or if you have a catalytic converter stolen off of your vehicle? Basically, you're gonna call our dispatch center 24 hours a day, seven days a week at 805-654-9511. And remember, if you have an emergency, always call 911. So to help protect yourself against catalytic converter theft, we encourage you to go to one of the local garages here in the city of Camarillo and have your catalytic converter etched with your vehicle license number, your VIN number, and then also a Sheriff's Star spray painted onto the actual catalytic converter. You can contact the Camarillo Police Community Resource Unit at 805-388-5131 and talk to me. Senior Deputy Mike Baker, and I'll give you a list of all the places that you can contact to have your catalytic converter etched and spray painted. In the event that you want to do something to help prevent somebody from stealing it, there's a couple of places in Camarillo that will also install an anti-theft device that prevents people from getting to this easily, and it works great.